Hi, and thanks for joining us for this mid-month climate and water outlook. The El Nino Southern Oscillation remains in neutral territory, though we have seen a cooling across the tropical Pacific in recent months. Likewise, there are cooler waters to the west of Australia, but the Indian Ocean Dipole also remains neutral. These influences from the Indian and Pacific Oceans are likely to be competing. The slight drying influence from the Indian Ocean is likely to be cancelling out the slightly wetter influence from the Pacific. This means that the October to December rainfall outlook shows an equal chance of wetter or drier than average conditions across Australia. Dry conditions in recent months have resulted in dry water catchments across parts of southern and eastern Australia. Near median to low stream flows are forecast across this region for September to November, but high flows are more likely for parts of Australia, such as the top end. We are also likely to see a continuation of warmer than average daytime temperatures for October to December, especially across the north and in the southeast. Nights are also likely to be warmer across much of this same region. However, there remains a risk of frost early in the outlook period. Thanks for joining us. Our end of month outlook will be released on Thursday the 28th of September.